My name is Joseph Lomenblit and I am a STS CEO and founder. Now is a winter time and uh, some of us uh, suffer from the cold symptoms and uh, from the stuffy nose. And uh, usually it passes through a few days, but if you, we have a chronic sinusitis, it can last for uh, several weeks. And chronic sinusitis, it's uh, a very comprehensive disease. One of uh, eight Americans suffer from it and has a long list of symptoms, including bad sleeping, uh, headache, uh, facial pain, uh, and even uh, fever. When the medication does not work, a uh, recommended solution is endoscopic sinus surgery. Uh, during this surgery, endoscope inserted into the sinus cavity and uh, enlarge it to provide aeration and drainage. Uh, but uh, unfortunately, this procedure failed in about 30% of patients and uh, even more during the first year after the endoscopic surgery, 50% uh, patients uh, declare that uh, the symptoms of uh, the sinusitis uh, recovers. We have uh, solved this problem with our innovative uh, composite stent. This stent is inserted just after the sinus uh, surgery and provide good aeration and drainage and uh, minimum tissue irritation. And the stent can be easily inserted and deployed and also easily removed. Therefore, this stent improves patient outcomes and deduct revision surgeries. Our innovative stent comprises two bodies nitinol and polymer and based on balloon expandable uh, balloon delivery system. Implanted uh, during uh, direct vision, endoscopic vision into the sinus cavity, deployed and is removed after the healing process complete. We have proved our concept on the several animal trials where the stents were inserted, deployed, and removed just in an acute study, and inserted, deployed, and removed after the uh, four weeks, with minimum tissue irritation, with uh, no ingrowth, and with minimum inflammation. The market, it's a big one, it's uh, almost underserved 1.5 billion, and based on the more than 1 million uh, surgeries in the US and Western Europe. The market activity is proved by the chain of the acquisitions and fundraisings. Our product based on the serious patent portfolio, based on uh, three issued US patents and uh, two more patent applications, and uh, also on the uh, easy regulatory path, because our stand is a class one medical device for uh, CE and uh, US uh, regulatory. ST stand has a very experienced uh, managing team uh, with uh, more than 30 years experience in the stent, uh, uh, stent development. And uh, we also have a, a very professional advisory board with uh, key opinion leaders in the U.S. and in Israel, Professor Gadi Arel, Linux Hill Hospital, U.S., and Professor Aidan Inif in uh, Rabin Medical Center. Thank you. Uh, as one who suffers from sinusitis every year, uh, I'm looking for a good product. Can re you relate to the balloons that are being used and were acquired in high numbers? If this is something which is a competition or you can combine your technology to the balloons? Mm -hmm. uh, it's a very nice question. Uh, uh, you know, in the last time it was a very uh, active uh, market and uh, uh, two uh, additional companies were uh, made, uh, one of them was a very, a good acquisition from uh, J&J, about $800 million. It's a clarent, balloon dilatation. It's additional uh, instrument for uh, endoscopic sinus surgery. And uh, another one, it's uh, Entelus with uh, another balloon, now made uh, uh, IPO in the NASDAQ. But a real competitor is the only one, because it's the only stand on the market. This is uh, Biabsorbable stand from uh, Intersect ENT called Propel. It has a lot of uh, disadvantages, uh, but you know it's uh, the first stand in the market. Like uh, you, you know, it's uh, uh, early 90s, uh, you have uh, the only stand on the cardiovascular. It was Palma Shah stand. It was a very terrible stand, but it was the only one and has 100% uh, of the market. But when the, another company, it's Medinal uh, near stand, comes to the market, it's uh, just uh, in a few months, uh, took about 80% uh, of the market. So, 
We'll see our future there.